Hi, this is Bree from Review Nerds. Today I am reviewing this KitchenAid food processor. I have used it a couple times now and honestly it's worked pretty well. Um, I will say what I like about this Hey, it's Mark from Review Stoners. Today we're going to review the indoor humidity and temperature monitor from Amazon, of course, and made by Adu Adaus. I'll, I'll fix all that later. It's D O D A U S. So I've already gotten one of these. It's been great. So here I have a stunt double box. So this is a brand new, um, there's nothing in this box. I'm gonna show everybody just in case you think I'm bleep. So here we go. This came like this. There's a little QR code on here. Uh, it's, it's in a box. Um, I did not scan with the transparency app on the other one, so I don't know what that would have done. Here's some numbers. Notice this is new. You know, I like the way that it, uh, the box is rectangular and three-dimensional, so that's, uh, that's a good thing. Over here's a whole bunch of warnings, I'm sure. And, oh, here we go. Make sure we see all the certifications. This thing is certified up the yin-yang and um, picture of it. I'm going to open the box. I'm wearing the wrong hat and I didn't fix my hair. So inside it's in plastic. The last person to touch this was probably in, made in China, yes. Chinese person. So in here is an instruction manual. Check this out. When is the last time? So not too much garbage, nothing else in here. Let's see. Uh, anyway, back to this. All right, what we have here is the HM, the HM1 humidity and temperature monitor. Instruction manual. So we have a ton of languages. So going from English to, oh my God, is that Russian? Specific, German maybe, Comfort, Danish, I don't know. Um, here we go. That looks French. They have a little bit of Specific, more French. Wow, expectations. Okay, so what it says to do in here is to first remove that little booger right there. Now make sure you dispose of this like freaking immediately. I wouldn't even trust myself to put it in this box because it's gonna find its way out and these clear things will get stuck to the hardwood floor. The no, the Roomba, the broom, nothing will ever, ever get rid of them. I'm actually tempted to throw this out the oven window, but I'm not gonna do it. So there, it's in the box. I'm gonna shut the box to make sure that oven thing does not get out. I keep looking at this camera, with this camera down here. So here is something I've been wondering what's going to happen. I don't know it's going to happen on camera after the first time. The previous one I got, which is right up there on the wall, when I first released the battery thing, it did not work. So I'm expecting when I turn this over for there to be nothing on the display. And I was wrong. So there we go. There's a little lesson for you. There is, it's working fantastically. Although we're in socialist mode right now. I'm pretty sure it's not 24 degrees in here. Burr. So, oh, the way you change that from socialist to Fahrenheit is right here on the back. See this button right here? I'm pointing to it with my finger. Okay, I'm going to press the button. I don't need a paper clip. I don't need a pen. I don't need any of that BS. 
I'm just gonna hit it one time. I turn it over magically, and it's still selfless. So I'm gonna turn it over again, and press it again, and it's still selfless. So I don't know what's going on, man. I might have to hold it down. Here we go, beak. Oh no. I think I just totally freaked it out. Here we go. It's 77.4 and we have 30% relative humidity. Also on this thing is the handy dandy operating stand that goes up like that. So you can do it like that, 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 or down and you can mount it and put this screw hole just like I have done right here with this one. Isn't that fantastic right there? Okay, so this concludes. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's one more thing to do. Just one more duty to perform on the front. Now that we're sure we're not going to return it to the Amazonians is this protective cover. I'm going to pee and it's off. And this is another one of those effing pieces of plastic that you must make sure you absolutely seal up in this. I would suggest that you go, I don't know, but this is your I mean, I would suggest that you go put this box in your food processor. <laughs> All right, cat bed. All right, we're in bed now. All right. Oh, the night was alive. Wow. Oh, where's the El Stapo? I am sad to report as part of my review that these two identical thermometer humidity measuring devices just received from Amazon from China uh, do not agree on anything. And they've been sitting here for a while, man. See? It's going the wrong direction. Oh, humidity, wrong way, man. Chinese, their mama does suck. And now, after accidentally dropping the thermometer into the dog water bowl, we have 99% relative humidity. I think that sounds good, man. The water is inside there behind the glass.